Hello YouTube, this is Kimberly coming to you guys with a um, video on basically how to save money on a mannequin hand um, and showing you how I apply my nail tips to the mannequin hand. So first of all we're just going to start off with how I made the mannequin hand and then we'll go from there. So I bought the mannequin hand from eBay, it was about I want to say less than $15. All I did was buy a lamp from Walmart. You can purchase a lamp from anywhere. It just has to have a gooseneck. Um, I believe that's what you call it. It just has to have this adjustable part. And if you would like to clamp the mannequin hand to your desk and then use it as like a one of those expensive mannequin hands, uh, you would get this clip that's attached to the lamp. So that when you're done disassembling it and then you screw it onto this mannequin hand at the base, um, you can clamp it onto your desk. So basically I bought the mannequin hand from eBay. I went to Walmart I bought this lamp with an adjustable neck on it and a clamp at the end. I unscrewed the top of the lamp I bought two screws that fit that look like they fit in this hole and I You know guesstimated it pretty accurately um, you unscrew the top of the lamp and um, Then you're gonna screw this base part this into the base of the um, mannequin hand after that you should be good to go if you choose to decorate your mannequin hand that's fully up to you mine is just plain plain and simple um, the nails I'm going to be using today are nails that I ordered off of eBay a while ago on accident the wrong type of nails um, I wouldn't use these on my natural nails or on a client's nails so I just keep them to use for my mannequin hand um, the nails I was using before these nails are nails I got from Family Dollar. These are about like oval shaped nails. They were about a dollar. These are uh, like a tapered square. They were a dollar as well. I'm just not using them at the moment because I don't have enough of each size to glue onto the mannequin hand. So today we're going to be using these. I'm going to show you how I glue one handed. I'm going to show you how I glue um, the nail tip to the mannequin hand using hot glue. Now be careful um, when you're using hot glue to glue the nails on because you can burn yourself. I'm not sure the age group that will probably be watching, the, be watching this video so make sure you're of age um, to be using a hot glue gun. Make sure your parents give you permission to use a hot glue gun. So what you're going to do is I'm going to try to do this one handed. I can't see. So you're going to put a little bit of hot glue onto the nail not too much well, after you put the hot glue on the nail you're gonna let it set for a few seconds just to let it cool because if you put the nail onto the hot glue gun I mean if you put the nail onto the um, hot glued area of the mannequin hand it will melt the nail so I would say about now is a good time to go ahead and glue this nail on so press the nail onto the mannequin hand it's still kind of warm, but that's okay. As long as it doesn't melt the nail, it's fine. So you're just going to keep pressing it until the glue spreads out underneath the nail. And you want to make sure that the nail will stick. Now, for some odd reason, if the nail pops off or anything like that, you should be able to go back in and hot glue it and then set it on there again. And it should stick. Um, but you just want to make sure that it's fully um, dry before you start applying your nail tips and your acrylic and stuff and filing because then it will pop off now I've only had a nail pop off like a maybe like a couple times but other than that I can file I can drill I can do anything and these nails will not come off unless I want them to come off now I would decorate them and then I would when I'm done decorating them I would just pop it off now when you go to pop the nail off with the acrylic on it you have to be very careful not to um, crack the nail that you just did which shouldn't be you know too hard so here's some nails that I've done these are all with acrylic um, I've, I've done these all on this mannequin hand and I've popped them off and you know nothing's happened to them I've got some different nails in here uh, but these are all just practice nails so that's pretty much how you glue your nail onto your mannequin hand and get it to stay. Now what I do after I let this dry, I have my nail tips ready. I, I glue these nail tips on with hot glue, let them dry. I clip them to the desired length. And then I would go in with my real nails, the nails that I would use on a client. 
and I would just use nail glue glue these on cut them and then go ahead and apply your acrylic your decorations and everything else and just go ahead and do it like it's a real set so and this is my version of saving money on a mannequin hand because I know that mannequin hand is very expensive I did not come up with this idea on my own I actually saw this on another youtubers account a while ago and I decided to you know recreate the idea because I was just getting into nails and stuff and I'm still new to nails but um, I thought it was a good idea now the nail tip part I believe I came up with this myself I haven't seen anybody else do this that's why I decided to come on and share this with you guys because I'm gonna you know do some practice nails right now just regular old hot glue gun that I've had from Walmart a regular old hot glue gun and hot glue sticks apply the hot glue apply the tips trim it to whatever length you would like it to be it's supposed to mimic a natural nail so I just you know do them kind of short then I glue my real tips onto the nail I apply my acrylic and whatever designs I'm going to do, file it, buff it, drill it, whatever you're going to do. And there you have it. Um, if you guys want to see any more videos or if you guys want to see my nail area or if you want to see anything regarding to nails or any videos, just let me know in the comments below um, and I'll do it. Um, great comments. And subscribe. That <laughs> sounds corny. Rate, comment, and subscribe to my video. And let me know what you guys want to see, okay? Thanks.